Yeah. And that's just so true. So true. Yeah. These guys are telling me my son's on the higher control. Hey, this sounds nice. No. Oh, I just. Thank you all for coming out. I think we should all just real quick give a hand to Riverside PD, Sheriff, Fire, First Responders. Thank you. We really had no idea how many folks were going to show up today. This is really awesome. Thank you very much. And Riverside PD and the Highway Patrol and the Fire, and the fire Department and I can tell you for a fact that this means a lot to them. It really warms their heart that you guys are coming out and doing this. Um, Pat, uh, Chaplain Steve Ballinger is going to say a prayer, and then we're going to have a national anthem, and then we'll get going. Well, good evening. Um, it's a real honor to be here. I had the privilege for 15 years to be the uh, lead chaplain with the Riverside Police Department and I love those men and women and uh, I know that uh, they are so grateful for what each and every one of you are, are doing this evening because so many of them are becoming discouraged not just in our department but across this nation and so to see the support uh, for law enforcement means a great deal to them and I just hope and pray that as you guys head down the road that you'll be bumping in the black and whites at every intersection. I, I pray that they will see what has taken place this evening because I know it's going to truly touch their hearts. So with that, would you join me in a word of prayer? Almighty God, we come before you and we thank you for being not only a God of love, mercy and grace, but also a God of justice. Over the years, we have attempted to kick you out of every segment of our society. Our schools, our businesses, our government, and even many of our churches want nothing to do with you. Father, the result of those decisions are being seen today, throughout and across this great nation, as lawlessness and godlessness appears to abound. Lord, we are living in what they have termed a cancel culture, and if that is true, I ask that you would cancel the cancel culture. Father, I ask that the days of our godless leaders would be few and that another godly man or woman would take their place. Oh God, help us as a nation and as a people to turn back to you, for you are our only hope and our salvation. And then and only then will mankind be able to truly love one another and live together in peace. Father, we thank you for all the men and women who serve in law enforcement here in our very own city, our county, our state, and our nation. They are, as your word says, ministers of God to us for good, who do not bear the sword for nothing, and who would bring judgment to those who practice evil. They are indeed that thin blue line between good and evil. Be with every officer as they work their beat, Help them to know that you are with them every step they take. Let them feel your angels on their shoulder as they put on the uniform, blue or tan, and to begin their shift. We are so very grateful for their willingness to walk the point. 
knowing the dangers of their job as they patrol the darkened streets and alleys alone, serving as warriors, protecting their community in spite of the many dangers. Help them to conquer their own fears and give them courage to do their job. Watch over them as they watch over our community. Help them to be mindful of all citizens who have sworn that they have sworn to protect. Give them understanding as they deal with both the young and the old. Give them strength to protect others and wisdom to lead others. May they always show concern for those who trust them and compassion for those who need them. Help them to always be dedicated to their profession and the community in order to keep it safe and help them to wear the uniform with honor. Oh God, we thank you for these brave men and women and for the totality of their contribution to their community, to their departments, and to their families. Your word tells us that there is no greater love than this, than to lay down one's life for a friend. And so we are thankful that these men and women are willing to be that thin blue line, knowing the price they might have to pay one day. We are thankful that these men and women of law enforcement are willing to give their today that we might have our tomorrow. As we see all the lawlessness taking place across our nation, especially toward our law enforcement officers, the lives of these men and women are in more jeopardy and harm than ever before. I pray, Father, that you would give to every law enforcement officer cool heads in heated moments, courageous hearts in adverse situations, wise judgment when making split decisions, and give them hard punches when a soft touch won't do, as they faithfully fulfill the duties and responsibilities that they have been called to. Father, many in law enforcement today have become discouraged and have quit their job, or they are considering quitting their job because of today's climate. Many feel hated for simply wearing the badge and doing their job. Help them not to give up. Help them to stay the course. Help them to fight the fight and let them know that they are loved. Father, we are here this evening because we want our officers, all first responders, fire and law, to know that they are loved and that we are so thankful for everything they do. Father, I ask that you be with all those who are driving through our city this evening to show our support for law enforcement. May many officers on duty and off see it and be encouraged by it and keep this group safe during this drive from those who might like to do harm. And this I ask and pray in your wonderful name. Amen. Amen. Woohoo! We cannot let that happen. We need to stand proud for our national anthem, yes. for our first responders, yes. for our police, for all those who are doing good for us. And it needs to be sung loud and proud. All right? So you need to join me. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight all the ramparts we watched and so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave let's do this Thank you. Um, just keep on rolling all right thanks